over adaptations in animals today. Does anyone have any idea on what an adaptation is? Anyone? A change in the animal. A change in the animal. Anyone else have any other idea? Okay. These are some adaptations that animals have. An adaptation is a trait or a characteristic that helps an organism survive. So it can be a physical adaptation, which is a modification to the body, which is very observational, and behavioral, which is something that the animal does, a way that the animal acts. Physical adaptations would be webbed feet, sharp claws, camouflage, whiskers, large beaks and birds, striped fur, and bright feathers. And there are many more physical adaptations. Behavioral adaptations would include speed, how fast or how slow the animal goes, hunting skills, how the animal catches its prey, and defense mechanisms that the animal only have. In the following slides, we're going to identify what type of adaptation the animal has and what it is. Remember that some animals are going to have more than one adapta adaptation. Okay, so this is a rabbit. What do you think its adaptation is? Brittany? Its ears. Its ears. And why do you, what about its ears? They're really big. They're really big. Why do you think its ears have to be really big, Molly? So they can hear. So they can hear. Do you think that a rabbit has more than one adaptation? No? Yes. Yes? What is it, Rick? Uh, it's legs. It's legs. What about its legs? They're longer. Longer. What about um, a behavioral adaptation? Are they fast or slow? Fast. Fast. To get away from whatever's going to eat them, right? Does anyone know what this is? It's a type of insect. They're around here. It's a walking. Do you know what, what the adaptation would be? Three? Appearance. It's appearance. It fits right into its surroundings. You, If you were to walk by it, you would never notice it in the woods unless you were looking for it. What is this? Okay. Skunk. What do you think a skunk's adaptation would be? Molly? It's smell. It's smell. The skunk uses its stench to keep away anything that's going to eat it. If you smell skunk, you don't want to go near it. Does anyone know what this is? Uh, snapping turtle? It's a snapping turtle. Do you know what the annotation is? It's shell. It's shell. If you look closely, shell is very pointed and the tail is pointed. It's hard to see in the rock, so it would be the camouflage, and a snapping turtle snaps at you, so that would be its modification. It's, it's the really mean. I live in the Titanic area, and there's two ponds in between my house, and in my yard in the summertime, the snapping turtles are like this big, and I'm so terrified of them, I just like walk away <laughs> because they are really mean. What's this? Brittany? <laughs> That's a camel. It's a camel. What would be a camel adaptation? Molly? It's pumps. It's pumps. It holds lots of water. They don't have to drink lots of water because they live in the desert. And I believe that the pumps hold all the water. And our last animal is a what? Raccoon. A raccoon. What is raccoon's adaptation. Okay. Uh, it's eyes. It's eyes. You're right. Uh, raccoons are nocturnal, so they have to be able to see in the night. They're e-fish, which are also nocturnal, and they have to be able to see them running around in the water. 